in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen today we reflect on the gospel of the friday in the third week of easter in today's gospel jesus gives us the words of the spirit leading to eternal life we have a choice to follow the spirit of god or our flesh saint peter helps us in directing us to jesus and his words of eternal life we now read from the gospel according to saint john chapter 6 verses 60 to 69 many of his disciples when they heard it said this is a hard saying who can listen to it but jesus knowing in himself that his disciples murmured at it said to them do you take offense at this then what if you were to see the son of man ascending where he was before it is the spirit that gives life the flesh is of no avail the words that i have spoken to you are spirit and life but there are some of you that do not believe for jesus knew from the first who those were that did not believe and who it was that should betray him and he said This is why I told you that no one can come to me unless it is granted him in the father. And he said, This is why I told you that no one can come to me unless it is granted him by the father. After this, many of his disciples drew back and no longer went about with him. Jesus said to the 12 Will you also go away Simon Peter answered him Lord to whom shall we go You have the words of eternal life and we have believed and have come to know that you are the holy one of God Let us read again and watch for the word phrase idea or the thought to stand out to us Many of his disciples when they heard it said This is a hard saying who can listen to it but Jesus knowing in himself that his disciples murmured at it said to them do you take offense at this then what if you were to see the son of man ascending where he was before it is the spirit that gives life the flesh is of no avail the words that i have spoken to you are spirit and life but there are some of you that do not believe for jesus knew from the first who those were that did not believe and who it was that should betray him and he said 
This is why I told you that no one can come to me unless it is granted to him in the Father. And he said, This is why I told you that no one can come to me unless it is granted him by the Father. After this, many of his disciples drew back and no longer went about with him. Jesus said to the twelve, Will you also go away? Simon Peter answered him, Lord, to whom shall we go? You have the words of eternal life, and we have believed and have come to know that you are the Holy One of God. Next step, Meditatio. Here we take that one word, phrase or idea which stood out and go over them over and over in our mind. The words that stood out for me, Lord, to whom shall we go? Next step, Horatio. Now, tell God that phrase which stood out, that reflection that came from it. Talk to him. Final step, contemplatio. You have spoken to God. Now expect God to speak to you. With silence, God speaks to us. Be still and know that God is near you.
let us now end with a prayer Dear God, we thank you for sending us Jesus and his words of eternal life. In moments of our doubts, anxiety, and indecisive moments, grant us the grace like St. Peter to boldly declare, Lord, to whom shall I go? In moments of my weakness and failure help me to listen to Jesus' words of eternal life and rise up again All glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning is now and ever shall be world without end Amen.